wanted to uh, talk a little bit about fashion. Now, I loved hearing this. When it comes to trends, we're already starting to see spring. Yes, spring! That makes me so happy! It's starting to trickle out uh, into the stores right now. So we've got your first sneak peek with Sandra Patana. Great trends. You're just so comfy and snuggly. Oh. You know, there's something to be said for this, uh, this fortunately, this trend that seems to have just exploded what we're calling this athleisure, which means we just yes. can kind of even take day wear clothes, but you know you start to put it on with a comfortable shoe. Do you remember when we've talked so many times about when the designers first put out that crop pant and yes. we thought it had a lifespan? Yes. But you didn't want it to go away because you all love your shoes and you all love to wear a heel and then you wanted to wear a flat. Yeah. I think that's happened with runners because we heard that runners as a fashion trend were going to go away. Can I tell you, today we're featuring Nordstrom and you know they started as a shoe retailer. I didn't know that. Yeah, and that's their original heritage mm -hmm. and they have always been known to me as the place to go for shoes and I can tell you from doing my sneak peek for spring yes there's no shortage of runners so you can all be comfortable is all that the time. good news for us or what yeah. like you can wear runners to work runners everywhere runners out I mean, yes, you can do the Nike runner. They always have those special exclusives. But these are like fashion shoes. But then you can do fashion shoes yes. too. So this first one, I love Tanika's this color palette. Um, so much fun because it shows you kind of the direction of where denim is going. Right. Which is, yes, embroidered, yes, printed. Yep. Um, so this one from, um, these great jeans with the star print sort of, to me, worked into well with that bomber jacket that continues to evolve. With but lace. One this, this one with lace and on the far sleeve, embroidery. That's Again, nice. two key t trends for spring. So anything that I'm thinking is a little more artisanal, mm -hmm. artistic um, in its craftsmanship is where I'm seeing it go and I love just doing the pleated little silk uh, cami underneath. Look at all the different textures on that. Mm -hmm. so you, but the color palette for me is right up my alley. Tamika, thank you so much. That's beautiful. The pale pinks, the blues. Now, according to Sandra, you're going to be seeing a lot of blue in spring, and I think that that's fantastic because that's a color that looks good on most people. And I, th I see it in the spectrum right from navy through to the royal blues and through to the soft pastel blue. So, nice. you know, so sometimes people feel that they look better in a shade of a color than yeah. other. It just allows them that opportunity. Now, here again is this whole feeling of taking an unusual material, yeah. a little more artisanal. This is a, a bit like a raffia, so we think about straw baskets, a woven skirt, mm -hmm. and done almost in that Americana stripe, yes. right? And the embroidered t-shirt, and of course the neckerchief doesn't go away. And then I love that we've just done this again with so a sock and a wrap. Yeah. The wrap is important, the sock is important, but you can see how you could take this whole look and put it on with a little pair of white runners. Oh, yes. And it would be perfect. Or a pair of flip-flops in the summertime. Everything so. with so much personality. And, you know, there's a reason for that. It's because, as you've mentioned, you can get basics at any price. You will spend the money on something, though, that is an original piece, right? Well, and I think we're also used to seeing the really basic pieces have flooded the market. Yes. And, and we can buy those all over the place. Right. But I think every season, it's really exciting if you can put just pieces in your cupboard that are really a little more special because yes you may run around your basics most of the time but isn't it more fun to pull out something a t-shirt like that a t-shirt yes. like that the rather thank than you your so basic thank you so much by the way you look thank beautiful you. Airplanes, little palm trees. Like it's just it's dream. Got personality. Flight dreams. Flight dreams. I like that. that. Oh, this is awesome. Isn't this cute? Yeah, I love it. So again, what we've done here is take and show you a new way to do the pant. Yeah. This one in lightweight woolen, so I'd say mm. this is great for transition. Pleats are coming back. Oh my goodness. That's we, scary. I know. We <laughs> swore they were never. <laughs> The slightly well, it's like if you have any bumps, you know, that pleat is going to extend the bump. So you really have to be careful about where the pleat lies, and, and it's where it lands. Whether the pleat comes in or the pleat goes yes. out. Yes. Much, you know, just depends how it folds. Those are on nice the and bus. flat. I like the way that well, I think falls. it's helpful that Devin is She's a little flat, flat in the tummy. So, yeah. Is we, that what that is? Does that come with the pants? Could we just have the flat stomach with the pants? <laughs> 
And then we've done the stripe underneath. Now, whether Cute. it's the Breton stripe or the colored stripe, but I think what's important here is there is also a trend. You talked about blue. Yes. Green is a big trend. Nice. Intarsia sweaters are big. Mm -hmm. So anything to do with these animal or bird motifs, you're going to see them quite strongly on the market. Yes. Love the bag. The bag, the, the bag, the bag. The oh, bag, my gosh. The bag is an investment. It is from Loewe, but okay. that bag actually can be worn three ways. It works so as nice. this way. It works as a clutch. It also works as a half knapsack, so it does some things in the shoe from Miu Miu, which is that beautiful pattern. I love the kitten heel. Yeah. Um, it kitten heel back with a vengeance, by the way. Yeah, and it just makes it a little more feminine, yeah. right? It can yeah. take a kind of a masculine look. Yes. And just make it that a little, little bit feminine. feminine. Very nice, and welcome to City Line. Thank you yeah. so much. Thank you very much. Thanks, Kevin. I don't think she's ever done City Line before. Yeah. She's great. She has it. I love her look. Oh, fancy, fancy. So a lot going on in the back. This well, is really nice. You know, Layered. I, you know, I had to do an outfit from Nordstrom that was sort of my personal yes. thing. So I know this is always over the top, but I knew we okay. that one little bit. So what I liked about this was really transitioning to evening and thinking about how you take and you move. You know, we've all just come through the holiday season when it was all like blinged out. Yes. What I did was I firstly start with the shoe. The shoe mm -hmm. from Manola Blahnik and I thought, you know, the one thing that can tip something to a more spring-like look is that ode to neon because neon has not gone away and maybe you don't want to do it in your clothing. Maybe you just want to do it in a shoe. shoe. Safer. Then with the black, I thought the trench coat being an important detail, this one was madcap. That's the best one I've ever I, seen. The best Look at the long ties at the elbow. Oh, like it's just, but that to me is one of those coats that's forever. You put that in your cupboard and yes. you will, you wear this with a pair of jeans. But do you need an army to get you into it? No. <laughs> Tie me up! No, actually, it's a slip on, easily oh, it's a slip done. On. It's just okay. a slip right through. So All that right. was easy. And then we did it over the new white shirt, which is one that just has a lot of layering. It was just a different version of. The one thing that's cool is this pant has the pleated half back skirt. What I would call oh. another classic piece that you will have in your wardrobe. That's attached forever. to the pant? It's attached to the pant. Tanika, so, you look lovely. Thanks. Give her a big round of applause. That's beautiful. When you can't the amount of layers. Do I want to wear pants? Do I want to wear pants? I'm gonna wear both. both. That works perfectly. That is great. Yeah, okay, so fun. let's talk about the cut of this pant because as you mentioned, we're seeing it everywhere. Sometimes it's gonna be slim, sometimes it's gonna be a little bit wide. Um, I think it's nice when you can carry the same pattern from, from top to bottom when you've got a pant with that cut. Yeah, and this one is longer. done in a knit. This is from Theory. Nice. So this is also great, I think, as sort of workwear transition, although we've chosen here to do it with a Nike running shoe. Yeah. You know, um, at the Nordstrom stores, they do an installation of um, Nike that is exclusive to them, which is a little bit more fashion forward. They carry some regular things, but yeah. you always look into this little pop shop for these really special pieces. And then we did it with sort of that typical jacket that we always see in black leather. That's right. But let's think about it doing it in suede and doing it in a color. Mm -hmm. It's a nice alternative. So I just thought the pop of color was fun. Can you just whip that jacket off for me so we can see? See, we've oh, done this cute. over a shirt. Isn't this pretty? It's a little peplum. A little peplum, that lovely shape. Like because that. it just graces all our body parts. Mm -hmm. And then I love that fluid sleeve going into the tight cuff. And you've it's done a little bit of everything. You've got office friendly, you've got the lovely athleisure, nod to athleisure, and then you've got the moto jacket, jacket. but you've got it all together and it works. Yeah, really Very nice. Pretty. Thank you. That's lovely. Textures. Wow. The textures are mm -hmm. wonderful. And I think, as you said, we're seeing that blue come through. We've seen the red. We're seeing the green. So there's definitely color in the spring palette. Right. And cool, this, cool I blouse. just think, is all cool. That's right? very cool. So for me, this off-the-shoulder trend has not gone away. But what I liked about this one from Stella McCartney is that it's done um, with the smocking. And again, yes. I think that that's a new detail, a feminine detail. I think that shirt is just awesome. As do I think the jeans are pretty awesome. Yeah, they're cool. So again, the shorter and this one is that in between. It's not the tight slim, mm -hmm. and it's not that wider pant. It's really one that just eases over the body. And you know, as my ode to Valentine's Day, how <laughs> could I not do this shoe? Look at the love in that shoe. That, a lot of love in that shoe, so that's really fun too. That's a really fun way to wear a flat uh, and be comfortable and be very stylish. So I'm happy they've come out with so many different varieties of that flat form, but like with height. 
What's nice. height, right? Yeah. And, and I, well, I like the height. Well, sometimes I think all of us like that feeling just of being a little, a little elevated, bit. and it still does give you your athleisure feel. Yes, it does. But it does it with style. Yes, it does.